I like uh, to be at schools that, that have a great academic tradition. I think we're going to have some fun with this football team and, and do it the right way. All right, guys, we've worked hard. We've talked about this now. All the hard work we've done only gets us ready to win. we got to go win tonight. That's what it takes. It takes playing smart, flying around, playing full speed. Man, the key tonight is being physical. The only thing I want you guys to do now is play with your heart. I think I know a little bit about you guys, and I think you got something special in you. I want that coming out tonight. Let me tell you guys, this is ACC football. It's good football, man, and you got to play every play like it's your last. And, man, I'm going to tell you what, I wouldn't want to coach any other football team in America than this one right here. This is for pride. That's what this one's for. And let me tell you, as well as I can tell you, the scoreboard means nothing right now. How we get to the end of this football game score is important. And that means, man, play like your hair's on fire. Pin your ears back, blow a couple snot bubbles. You make sure that in every way, whoever cares about you is proud of you in watching you play this football game. You play full speed, play with class. Man, play your hearts out. Play as hard as you've ever played. Let's go out and play our best football game today. Let's go to work. Everybody loves him. He's made us work so hard, but it's all paying off now. He's been there for us through everything. Thank you so much. All the glory and honor goes to you, Father. Thank you for this football team. Come in. It's going to be some adversity. I don't know what it's going to be. Pull together as a family. There's going to be highs and lows. Don't get too high. Don't get too low. Stay out there working hard. Four quarters, chopping wood. Let's go play for pride. Get after it. Let's go. Make sure in the morning, you've got a lot to be thankful for. Get up, go to church, thank the Lord for the opportunity to play football here. Man, I'll tell you what, I've been around a lot of football teams. I've been a lot, around a lot of good football teams. And I'm going to tell you what, I've never been around one before that has the heart and character that this one does right here. Congratulations. I couldn't be prouder of you. Pull it up. Let's go. All right, guys, it doesn't get any better now. This is as good as it gets. we got to play good tonight. You know what we got to do tonight now, guys? Offense, take care of that football. Defense, find turnovers out there. Fly around and find the turnovers. Play hard, play smart, play your best football game tonight, guys. Let's pull together and go get them. Go. To the 35, to the 30, with a blocker in front. 20, 10, 5, dives, touchdown! All right, guys, today now, don't forget this, for four quarters, you got a bunch of people that love you watching you play today. And they live and die with every play on that field. You treat every play like it's life and death today. It's the 20 great block, 10-5, touchdown Wake Forest. All right, guys, let me tell you what, your coaches love you. We want to watch you play great football tonight. We want to help you play great football tonight. Let me tell you one thing, guys, and this never changes. When the game's over tonight, you want everybody that leaves that stadium to say that's the hardest playing football team I ever saw. Let's go. I'm so blessed. I'm so blessed to have a great coaching staff. And I'm truly, truly blessed to have a group of guys that no matter what happens, they don't get down. And guys, you won today. You won today for one reason. Because you never gave up on each other and you just found a way. I can't tell you how proud we are to be coming to the Orange Bowl. And I promise you, we will play like our hair's on fire for you. If we had Riley Skinner here or one of his teammates, what would they say defines a Jim Grove coached team? Well, I hope they would say that, that it's all about uh, team, you know, not individuals. I think too many times teams get caught up in stats and kids are worried more about their individual success than the team success. Oh, yes, Let me tell you what, guys, there are a lot of teams, the way that first half ended, would have gone back out in the second half and tucked their tail. You guys closed your neck and got after it. I couldn't be more proud of you. The guy just wins football games. He's got a formula, and it's working. Andrews to the five, breaks a tackle, touchdown, icing on the cake for Wake. Well, we have a lot of nail biters, that's for sure. I was proud of our defense. I thought both teams, both uh, teams played great defense tonight. It was a defensive struggle. I was glad that we got the ball in the end zone when, it, when we had to. I'm telling you now, I'm telling you now, these, these wins are things that we're capable of doing all the time. We're yeah. capable of doing this week. The feeling we got right now is the feeling we can have every week. 
If we want it bad enough, that's the key. You know what I found out today? You guys like to fight. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah!